Hey guys and welcome back to Beamer Tom and today we're going to be taking a talk or a look at the new BMW 4 Series and especially talk about this grill that's been leaked online so stay tuned for this video. So for months now there's been much speculation of what BMW are actually doing with their 4 Series as we've seen camouflage prototype photographs with the grill, we've seen certain spy shots or people taking shots of the car in containers and things like that and the grill seems to be changing size almost every time I see a different image of it. Yesterday on Instagram, I came across some photographs of the new 4 Series Coupe. It's actually amazing how closely it does look like the 4 Series concept or Concept 4 that was revealed in September at Frankfurt. The front grills are nearly identical in terms of the size. The front grille pattern shown looks like it's reserved for the M Performance models that you see in the Z4M with the kind of little dots all over the grille. I'm wondering or curious if the lower trim G22 4 Series is going to be known as We'll have the same oversized grille with a different pattern inside. It'll be interesting to see that when it officially gets debuted. Uh, it remains to see which the pattern will do, but the new M4's grille is equally going to be in your face. I guess that's going to be more aggressive and just the same way the last gen M4 was so kind of overdone. But yeah, apart from the front of the grille just being very <laughs> bold, shall we say, I think the rest of the car looks quite good. It's got a lot of 8 series built into it, especially around the rear of the car. That kind of C-pillar to the boot, that this whole section just looks really good. And from the photographs anyway that I've seen of this, it looks like a brochure that's opened up. Uh, the alloy wheels on this one looks quite good. Nice blue paint. Front headlights are quite nice and slender as well. Looks like there could be laser lights as well at the front of that. Obviously a more pedestrian 4 series won't look like that would be as exciting. Interestingly with the regards to the colour options from the brochure, we can see you're going to get Alpine White, which is pretty standard, Mineral White. We're also going to get the Black Sapphire, the Blue Stone looks quite cool, Sunset Orange, Arctic Race Blue. We're going to get some a green colour Sun, Remo Green. Also get Black Non-Metallic, which I think is just going to be your Jet Black. Brilliant White Metallic, Deep Frozen Grey, uh, Tanzanite Blue, to name a few. And we can also, I guess we're going to expect a whole range of petrols and probably diesels going to continue for another few years at least here in the UK anyway and I'd like to see the being electric the 330E and the 530E powertrain in the 4 series I think that would help sell well especially if company car buyers but yeah comment below what you think of the 4 series and what you think of these images that were leaked online quite interesting time we're living in how fast things are progressing on the internet uh, away from official launches uh, like I said I quite like the look of it overall it's very Polarizing definitely gets people talking. People, people can definitely can't say BMW aren't taking risks anymore with the front of the car. If you think back to the four series that I had back in 2014, it had a very small grill that stretched out. Now this, this grill is almost the whole front face of the car from the top of the bonnet, or so the way the bottom, so the top of the bumper that meets the bonnet to the bottom of the bumper. So it's very large looking. But anyway, we'll see this in real life, I'm sure, in the next month or so. But this is pretty interesting to see. Uh, comment below what you think of the <laughs> huge grill if there's any other features of the car you quite liked. Um, but yeah, just want to say thanks very much for watching Beamer Tom. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're a BMW enthusiast or owner, make sure you subscribe to this channel. This channel's for you. And I'll see you next video. Ciao.